Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to Crystal Vision 1111. This is the general love reading for the collective. Not all of the messages that come through today may apply to everyone watching. So please only take in from this reading what resonates for you and for your situation and release the rest to the universe. Do I still have a chance? Your person is really thinking a lot about how they acted with you. The problems they created, the mistakes they made, the drama they created and perhaps perpetuated. And they know that they created such a big, huge mess in this connection with you. It is causing them to wonder if they do still have a chance to rebuild this connection with you. They know they need to apologize. They know they need to make it right. They know they need to make it up to you. They know that they need to tell you how they feel. And they will. But this is really heavily weighing on your person's mind right now. Do I still have a chance? They're obsessing about this. Wondering if it's too late. If you've moved on. If there's someone else in your life. They know what they have to do to rebuild this connection with you. And as they obsess about this and think about what a future with you would look like, they will reach out to you to apologize and ask you for an opportunity to give them another chance. I hope that one day you can forgive me. I got that totally wrong. I hope that you can forgive me one day. Yeah, see, do I still have a chance? I hope that you can forgive me one day. Your person is really thinking and taking ownership of the problems that they've created in this connection. For the chaos, the conflict, the confusion, the drama, how they made you feel for hurting you, denying the connection, they're running, they're ghosting. They will come forward to you with a very sincere, heartfelt apology because they're going to hope that you have the grace within you to forgive them for their actions, for their low vibration behaviors, for the hurtful, mean words that they said to you that crushed your spirit and that broke your heart. They're taking accountability for the problems that they created, which is why they're going to ask you to forgive them and also ask you if you will give them another chance with you. I am not over you. Of course your person isn't over you. If they were over you, they wouldn't be thinking about another chance and hoping that you would forgive them one day. Your person can't get over you. Perhaps they've tried. Perhaps they've tried to push thoughts from their mind. Perhaps they've tried to close off their heart by thinking about other things and focusing on other things and really staying busy in their lives. But no, they see something, it reminds them of you. They hear something, they start taking trips down memory lane. Your person is not over you. If they were over you, they would have moved on and they wouldn't be having these thoughts. And the universe certainly wouldn't be giving them signs and synchronicities because there would be no point. But the people upstairs, your angels and guides, as well as your person's angels and guides, know that the two of you belong together. This is why they are working to try and get your person to the place where they can find that courage within themselves to reach out to you, to start talking to you, and give this connection the chance for a fresh start. I see life differently now. Yes, your person sees life from a very different perspective as a result of having you in their life. Now, when they were with you, they felt so positive. They felt like they were on top of the world. They felt like they could accomplish anything because you gave them that support and that encouragement. You supported their dreams. You bolstered their self-confidence. Their world is not the same without you in it. They don't like their world without you in it. But in seeing life differently, they have a greater understanding of the meaning in life. They know that there is this deeper 
meaning to their lives. And that deeper meaning includes this relationship with you. They understand that love is important, that it's not something that you're supposed to run from or create problems and conflict with. They understand that you are the one for them. And this is something that your person has had a major breakthrough about. I can't stop thinking about you. Again, you are on your person's mind. They are thinking about you all the time. They think about what a future with you would look like. They think about where you would live, if you would have a family, where you would go on the weekend, what you would do, what your house would look like. They think about all of these things. They project those thoughts into this future with you in their mind. They think about what you're doing. They wonder how your day went. When they get up in the morning, they think about you, wondering what you're going to do that day. When they come home at night, they think about you before they go to sleep, hoping that the universe will grant them a wish in giving them a dream about you. You are on your person's mind. They can't stop thinking about you just like you can't stop thinking about them. They want you to forgive them because they want another chance with you. They're not over you just like you are not over them. This is your reading for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this reading, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Have a great day, everyone.